work, white linen, all black windows. I had to tint them that work, work. Put them in the dirt, let them all lurk. No, I had to get up with dirt. We never hurt, hurt. No, the deal. Tour sold out, so you know it's real. <sighs> all right. Yo, YouTube, this is your boy Bati. Welcome. Okay, I'm gonna be all oh, my cool here. I can't. It's your boy Potsy, and this is my quick review of the Royal Rumble match. I'm not gonna do the whole thing. Don't feel like doing it. I'm tired. It's late. I gotta get to bed. I got work in the morning. Um, I just want to talk about the Royal Rumble match. Um, overall, the Royal Rumble, loved it. I loved it. I loved it. I loved it. It's a good pay per view. This, but this man, this this Royal Rumble was the very very anticipated. It needed, I was, oh my god, I was looking forward to this all damn month. With with everything going on in wrestling, with the signings from New Japan Pro Wrestling, everything from NXT, Austin Aries coming, signing with the company, holy shiza, everything is starting to feel awesome around here. Tonight was the night where it's going to start be becoming to change, Okay. Um, right off the bat, week, <laughs> oh my goodness, you had Ro Roman Reigns coming at one, Rusev coming at two, and then this man, the phenomenal AJ Styles, that crowd freaking popped, <coughs> my throat, I'm probably going to be coughing in this video, I'm going to make this short and sweet though, I was yelling and I was shocked. I don't know if you follow me on Twitter, but follow me on Twitter is at Potty Gaming. Uh, I I love it. Follow man, follow man. You, you see what I do. I was I from that on. I don't I didn't really tweet the whole Royal Rumble until AJ Styles came out. I was just oh my goodness, and the whole thing you know from you had that you got it was it was pretty much everyone was coming out. It was a good like beginning of the like 15, 20 minutes. Yeah, Jericho come out really early. You had pretty much the jobbers come out and all that stuff. The well, you know, not really the ones that get TV time come out. You had Kevin Owens, the very injured, you know, pretty much hobbling on one leg. Kevin Owens still fighting and go straight to uh, AJ Styles, which was so, so awesome. That crowd ate, ate it up, and I, I sure as hell did. Um, then you had uh, round number 20, you had Sami Zayn come out. Crowd popped even more because in Florida it's the hometown. NXT's there. You had to get Sami Zayn, Kevin. Of course, Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn had a you know had the feud. It's still going on probably till this day. I loved it. Um, and then back and back and forth, you had Lesnar come out, which he went suplex city. And then you had the Wyatts. Now this is where I'm gonna start liking. It. If they're gonna keep having Wyatts and and Brock, maybe Bray versus Brock for at Wrestlemania, please do it, that would be awesome, it's literally just going to be bright talking to Paul Heyman anyway, so I'm going to love it, um, and the whole thing too is, the League of Nations pretty much kicked the shit out of Roman, so he was going, I knew, every, they were making not talk to Roman the whole time, you didn't hear about Roman till the end, which I loved and enjoyed, um, so pretty much from that on, it was, you know, it was, it was a great, great rumble, you know, we, and then, I really think, okay, um, number 30, all right, you had the Miz coming out like 27, you had a bunch of people, and then it was just like, all right, who was number 30, who is it going to be, is it going to be, Bri you know, Daniel Bryan, is it going to be Shinsu Nakamura, you know, who, who is it going to be, and I'm thinking, dude, it has to be like, somebody new, and then you heard Triple H's music, and I'm thinking, Oh my god, like, I was so, like, what? This is really gonna happen? It's gonna be, it's really, really gonna happen. It's gonna be Roman versus Triple H for the title at WrestleMania. It's gonna happen, you know? And I'm thinking, oh my god, and the final four was just odd. I think it was Jericho, Dean, Triple H, and Roman. That was the final four. You had Brock Lesnar, you had AJ Styles, you had Dean and Roman. You could have had that Final Four. My good, even Kevin Owens. You had that. It was just like, oh, uh, because it was. I don't know, man. It was. Uh, I'm so salty right now, but I really, really enjoyed the Rumble. This is what I was. 
after last year's Rumble, man, I was so disappointed. But this, I'm, I'm back and forth, man. I didn't really want to see Triple H win it. But by God, it's like, oh my God. If you follow me on Twitter, you know how pissed I was. They, they keep teasing us as, you know, Dean Ambrose coming up short, winning the big one. I'm like, oh my God, stop. Give this man the title. But I mean, this is, I just, I don't know. Don't know, but this, I'm, um, I'm just, this is, oh god, I can't talk. I'm so frustrated, and I'm tired, and I apologize. So, but um, I'm gonna wrap this video up. If you love, oh, I'm gonna edit that part out. So, with that being said, please leave a like. And what do you think of the Royal Rumble was? Did you, really, did you enjoy the Rumble? I enjoyed it. What do you think overall? Did you like the Rumble Bowl match? You like, you know, the Divas match? You like Kevin Owens versus, you know, Dean Ambrose? You like that? You like the New Day? Tell me what you think about the Rumble. What do you think from now on? What the WWE is going to do? What are you going to do with AJ Styles? Tell me, tell me in the comments what what the future holds for WWE till WrestleMania. But from now on, this is your boy Potsy, and I'm out. And I'm gonna go cry because Triple H is champion now. Who are we going to bring? Austin? We're going to bring The Rock? Well, who are we going to bring? The Ministry of Darkness? Why is he champion? <laughs>